Wow! Look at all this stuff! <laughs> cool! Look at this, Caillou! Why is that window so tiny, Daddy? It's a window for an archer. From inside, there's plenty of room for arrows to go out. But on the outside, it's very hard to get an arrow in. So it keeps the archers safe. Oh. <gasps> <laughs> wow. Hmm. Caillou the Great, what are you doing? I've been working on some magical projects for the king. What kind of projects? Well, the king wants me to make sure there's lots of food for all the people in the kingdom. Watch this! <laughs> wow, Caillou, that was really... on that spell a bit more. Uh-oh! We're under attack! What is going on here? <laughs> Caillou! Caillou! Hello? Uh, uh, sorry, Daddy. You were off in your own world there. I was! I was a wizard, doing a spell, and there was a giant, and the magic spaghetti started to get really big and chase Leo. Cookies. Done! Not quite, Caillou. Mr. Hinkle gave you five dollars for five boxes of cookies. You've only given him three. <gasps> yeah, that's not right, Caillou. Oh, sorry. So you have three, 
Here's four and five. <laughs> Thank you very much, Caillou and Clementine. Thanks, Mr. Hinkle. Yeah! Have a nice day. Wow, we already sold ten boxes of cookies today. I wonder if we can sell twenty. Or thirty. Or fifty. Or a hundred. <laughs> <laughs> It's all right, you two. There's nothing to be afraid of. These people are marching. Marching? Why? People march when they're unhappy about something big and they want to change it. They march with signs to let the people in charge know how they feel. Why are they shouting so loudly? Yeah. What are they upset about? Well, they want to get everyone's attention. This is a protest to stand up against racism. What's racism? Oh, Mommy told me. Racism is when people are mean to each other because of their skin color. Right, Mom? That's right, Clementine. See, there was a time when you two wouldn't have been able to play together just because of the colors of your skin. Really? Yes. People with darker skin like me and Clementine were not allowed to do the same things as people with lighter skin like you, Caillou. You two wouldn't have been able to swim together or ride the bus together or even eat at restaurants together. It's not fair. Lots of people agreed, Caillou. So they all marched together, just like this. And things changed and got better. So now you and Clementine can both play together and do all the same things. Oh. So marching is a good thing. It is, Clementine. Sometimes people are still mean to people with darker skin, like us. So all these people are trying to make things better. And when lots of different people all come together like this, they can change the whole world. Wow! Water! Free water! I'm sorry. It's okay. Oh, hi, Caillou. Hi, Clementine. Hi, Jeffrey. What are you doing with all that water? Me and my parents are passing them out to thirsty people on the march. That's so nice. Hey, you two. Should we get back to selling cookies? Well, some of the people marching look kind of hungry. Could we give them some cookies? Oh, can we? Can we? I think that's a wonderful idea. We can spare a few boxes. Water! Water! Free water! Cookies! Cookies! Free cookies! You see, Mommy, I need to choose the right brush so that the egg doesn't crack. brush is too hard, but this one is nice and soft. Well done, Caillou. Do you like painting eggs, Mommy? I do, Caillou. But you know what I like even more? Hunting for eggs. Hunting for eggs? In the store? <laughs> no, no. In the garden. Why would you search the garden for eggs? We don't have a chicken. <gasps> do we? <laughs> no, but the eggs I'm talking about don't come from birds. They're sweeter than other eggs and very tasty. 
<gasps> These eggs are made of chocolate. And even better, they're delivered by the Easter Bunny. Easter Bunny? Yes, he's going to hop around the garden and hide Easter eggs for you to find. <laughs> the Easter Bunny is going to hide chocolate eggs in our garden? <laughs> yes, Caillou. So, time for bed. You'll need lots of sleep so you're ready for the egg hunt tomorrow. But how does the Easter Bunny get here? <laughs> Where does it keep all the egg? Don't its paws get sore from carrying all the eggs? I think it's time to sleep now, Caillou. Close your eyes, and when you wake up, you can go hunting for eggs. The Easter Bunny won't come while you're awake. Little look won't hurt. <gasps> the Easter Bunny. Gilbert, we've got an Easter Bunny to find. Too quick and a very good hider. We have him cornered now. Caillou, what are you doing outside at this time of night? Bunny away. Caillou, you should be in bed. It's very late and you shouldn't be outside alone. Bye-bye, Easter Bunny. See you again next year. <laughs> Tech, you're it! Over here! Whoa! How'd you get there, 
here so fast? Clever boys. <laughs> Daddy, can you look after Jason's backpack while we go to the bathroom? Of course. After my backpack. That was quick. <laughs> no problem, Jason. <laughs> Thanks for looking after my backpack. Can I get it back now? Jason, didn't I just give you your backpack? <laughs> no. We just got back. Oh, shoot. I'm so sorry, Jason. I don't know who I gave it to. <laughs> there. I think... Oh, of course. Jeffrey! <laughs> nice prank. <laughs> Do you want to meet my friend? <laughs> my name's Jason. Jason! That's me. Do you want to see a magic trick, Rosie? Jason! Ta-da! <gasps> Jason! <laughs> Jason! <laughs> Don't worry, Rosie. They're twins, see? They just look the same. <laughs> <laughs> My name's Jeffrey. <gasps> Jason's. <laughs> 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 Come on, Caillou. Broccoli is good for you. I don't want broccoli. If you don't eat your vegetables, Caillou, you won't get any ice cream. Ice cream? Woohoo! Stop it, Rosie. I don't want broccoli. That's it, Caillou. Go to your room. No dessert. You're grounded. Bye. Broccoli is so gross, Teddy. I hate it. I never want to eat it ever again. Hmm. 
Oh, hello. Hello. Can Caillou come out and play with us? I'm sorry, Leo. Caillou isn't allowed out today. He's been oh. very naughty, so he's grounded. Oh, Caillou mad. Okay, we'll see him another day, I guess. <clears throat> Leo! Clementine! Wait there! I'll come down! No, Caillou! You'll get in trouble! doing? Caillou, I'm speaking to you. What do you think you're doing? I, I just wanted to see my friends. You're grounded, Caillou. You were very naughty earlier. I know, but... No buts, Caillou. And you definitely shouldn't try to sneak out. What if you had gotten hurt? Or lost. We wouldn't have been there to help you. I... I... Uh, I'm sorry. I'm not allowed out today because I was bad earlier. Okay, Caillou. We'll see you another day. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to get so mad. And I'm sorry for scaring you, Rosie. Caillou, mad. It's okay, Caillou. Thank you for apologizing. I'll go back to my room now. you finish your broccoli. That Caillou, you'll break it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Come on, it's time to explore. Let's go! <laughs> Caillou, we're perfectly safe. Castle! Hmm. Oh, almost, Rosie. That's Buckingham Palace, where the Queen lives. A real palace? Oh, can we go, Mommy? Can we? Of course. And through here is Her Majesty's throne room. These were used, of course, as part of the Queen's coronation ceremony. What's a coronation ceremony? Coronation is when a member of the royal family becomes the king or queen. Cool. <gasps> and if you'll follow me through here is the gift shop. Monty rather likes you. He's so cute! Oh yes, and quite the handful. <laughs> Tell me, how did you find your way in here? <gasps> oh no! I was on a tour with my family, but they must have left without me. Oh, not to worry, Caillou. This place is so big, it's quite easy for one to get lost. The next stop on the tour is the gift shop. Just through there. If you hurry, you'll catch them. Phew. Thank you. Bye, Monty. There you are, Caillou. I was on my way to find you. Sorry, Mommy. I got a bit lost, but a nice lady and her dog helped me. She sounds very kind. <gasps> Looks just like Monty the dog. Can we get it? Sure, Caillou. Hey! That's the lady that helped me.
<laughs> Very good, Caillou. But how about we try it for real? It's too loud! <laughs> that was awesome! Whew. Say, how about we try that police car next? You are under arrest, mister. Oh no, Grandpa! Where are you going to take me? We're going downtown. I've got some questions for you. <gasps> <laughs> Actually, uh, I'm uh, much too tired to arrest anybody today. Hop out, Caillou. Grandpa, Grandpa, what's this one? That's a garbage truck, Caillou. <gasps> Ew! Grandpa, what's that smell? <laughs> <laughs> Come and take a look at this. Whoa! What happens to it after it's been crushed? Well, some of it goes to a big landfill, and the rest, like paper, plastic, and some metal, gets recycled. Which means it gets made into something completely new, hmm. so that it can be used again. A train! This must be for really big farms. Oh, well, let's hop in, Farmer Caillou. Well, I'd say we're going to have a good harvest this year, Farmer Caillou. Yep, lots of carrots and potatoes and, and, and candy. <laughs> Candy? Wow, this must be a very special farm indeed. <laughs> Say, we'd better get you home, Farmer Caillou. Why don't you take these with you? Wow! Thanks, Grandpa! I can't wait to show Mommy and Daddy! Wow! I love the fairground! It's the best place in the whole world! Now hold on, Caillou. I don't want you getting lost, okay? We're all going to stick together. <sighs> okay, Mommy. Oh, look! They've got a coconut shy. Let's give it a go. Coco shy! All right, guys. You're about to find out why my school friends <laughs> used to call me Horus, Destroyer of Coconuts. Oh. 
Whoops. Oh, my turn. Uh, uh. I Whoa. did it! I did it! Well done, Caillou. You won a prize. Which one would you like? Looks like Gilbert. Can I have that one, please, Mommy? Here you go. Now, I bet I can't do nearly as well as you just did. Wait that till Gilbert really sees cool. this. Huh? <laughs> <gasps> Whoa, that cotton candy looks amazing. Do you want me to look after your toy, Caillou? Well... Caillou? Wow! Can I have some cotton candy, Mommy? <gasps> Mommy? Oh, oh no! Uh, I'm lost! A better view. Aha! Uh -huh. uh, no good. Still not high enough. Maybe. Aha! Uh -huh. Caillou! 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 Let's try the Ferris wheel. From all the way up there, we might be able to see where Caillou is. Uh, I can't see him anywhere. Uh, I can't see them anywhere. <gasps> there, I see him. He's gone into the Hall of Mirrors. Mommy! Daddy! Caillou? <gasps> are you in here? Mommy? Mommy! Caillou! Caillou. Uh, uh... 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 <gasps> huh? Caillou, thank goodness we found you. Where have you been? I'm so sorry, Mommy. I didn't mean to get lost. I saw the cotton candy stall, and then you were gone, and... It's okay, Caillou. I'm just happy we found you. You shouldn't run off on your own. It's so dangerous. And if you do get lost, you must find a police officer or someone else in charge, okay? I won't do it ever again. I promise. Well, I think we've had enough fairground excitement for one day. Come on, everyone. Let's make our way to the exit. Um, does anyone know where the exit is? Now we're all lost. Huh. I know. We should find a police officer. Right, Mommy? <laughs> 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 That's a great snail, Andy. But aren't snails kind of scary? Snails aren't scary. My favorites. Oh, but they're so slimy and... <gasps> what is that? Okay, class. This is a fire alarm, so we all have to leave the classroom. Please find your buddies. Follow Miss Shelley outside and line up in the playground. Buddy, remember? <gasps> Andy? <laughs> Great job, everyone. Now 
nice and steady now. Oh, Mrs. Martin, I think it's too loud for Andy. He needs his headphones. Good idea, Caillou. They're just over there by his backpack. Thank you, Caillou. Now come along. We need to go to the playground. Great job, everyone. This was just a practice, but you were all very calm and did what you were told. So well done. And now, it's recess time. Have fun. <laughs> It's recess now. Do you want to play catch? I have your special ball. Everything okay, Caillou? Me and Andy were having a lot of fun drawing, but he doesn't want to play with me anymore. Hmm. Well, you know, Andy really doesn't like loud noises. So that fire alarm was extra scary for him. Yeah, I get scared too sometimes when it's dark. It isn't nice. Exactly. Just give him some time and he'll be back to his usual self, I'm sure. Ah! <gasps> get it away! Clementine, are you okay? It's a snail! Ew! Snails are slimy and scary. Don't worry, Clementine. It's perfectly harmless. We'll move it out of the way for you now. Snail! Cool! That's right! Snails are Andy's favorite! Can you help us get the snail away from Clementine? Snails don't go on slides. Ugh. Time to go home, snail. Wow, that was amazing, Andy. Yeah, you saved me. Yes, well done, Andy. That was quick thinking. See, Caillou? The alarm may have been scary and painful for Andy because of his autism, but the snail wasn't. Everyone has things they find hard to cope with, but that's okay, because we all help each other when we struggle. Yeah! Got you! Catch! <laughs> Here it comes! I'm so excited to see the Dinosaur Museum! <sighs> okay, class. When we tour the museum, remember to stay with your trip buddy. That way, mm -hmm. no one will get lost. Hey, Clementine! Are you ready to be museum buddies? Yeah, Caillou. I'm just waiting here for my mommy before we go in. <laughs> I mean, my other mommy. You must be Caillou. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Jasmine, Clementine's mom. I work here at the museum as a dinosaur expert. Uh, Clementine? You have two mommies? That's right. We both take care of Clementine, and we both love her very much. Oh. Wait, you work with dinosaurs? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Oh, let's pretend to be dinosaurs! <laughs> <laughs> okay, class, are we ready? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> this is a dinosaur skeleton. 
Can anyone tell me which of these dinosaurs it belongs to? A Tyrannosaurus? A Brontosaurus? Or a Stegosaurus? Tyrannosaurus? That's right, Caillou. Great job, Caillou. Hi, Rexy. Pleased to meet you. Please don't touch, Caillou. Why not? The dinosaur bones are millions of years old, so they can break very easily. Millions? A very long time ago. Whoa! So, these bones are older than Daddy? <laughs> oh, Caillou, yes. Even older than Daddy. This is how cavemen and women dressed a long time ago. See how they didn't wear t-shirts or shoes? They wore things like animal fur and grass. Wow! This is a cast of one of the biggest dinosaur footprints ever found. <laughs> Whatever made this footprint must have been huge. Caillou. <laughs> That's a very creative idea, but it's just make-believe. <sighs> That's Caillou. He has a dinosaur-sized imagination. <gasps> <laughs> 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 